Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I have a photo shoot in a village near Ras. I'm going now. Uh, it's gonna be a photo shoot for the beauty competition for the 15 to 17 years old in my region. Uh, and I'm taking with me the Nikon Z62 with the macro lens 105 millimeters f 2.8. I'll try to use it for portrait photography today and I will be vlogging and doing some behind the scenes with this uh, DJI Action 3 and the Holy Land Lark M1. It's gonna be a bit different than the videos that I've been posting on my channel recently. So if you are interested in behind the scenes and some tips and tricks for portrait photography, I would highly appreciate if you subscribe to my channel. That's a massive help. If you watched my previous video, I was talking about the settings that works the best for me for vlogging situations. I'm gonna be using them in this vlog, in this behind the scene video. And uh, now the weather outside, it's really cold. It's two degrees and the photo shoot will be outdoors. So I hope it won't freeze. What I love about vlogging with the DJI Action 3 is that it's too small, too compact. You can pack it in your pocket. You can rely on it, really. It has a great image quality. Well, in the settings that I found the best, I have the, a great image quality I'm satisfied with. And I can give it to anyone. It's not a hassle. They can film, they can record some behind the scenes easily with it when I'm doing my portrait photography. So that's something really nice. On the Sony ZV-10, it's a bit difficult to convince someone that is not a photographer or a content creator to use it to film me when I'm doing my behind the scene, my videos and my photo shoots. Uh, but this one is easy to use. Uh, they all enjoy using it. So that's why I got DJI Action 3 to vlog and to film the behind the scenes for this photo shoot. By the way, I have with me also the 85 millimeters f1.8 from Nikon. I have also the 28 to 75 millimeters 2.8 Z mount from Nikon as well. I'm doing also a video about the 28 to 75 very soon on my channel. So if you are interested, don't hesitate to ring the bell so you will receive all the notifications about my future posts. Let's go start shooting with this macro lens, 105 millimeters, 2.8. The shutter speed is set to 1, 125, f2.8. The ISO is set to 100, the base ISO of this Z62. Don't forget to subscribe. One freezing hand and one covered hand with the PGY tech gloves. Don't wait for nobody. I'm a summer name on the dotty. City lights call my name, drawn to the flame, and I'm feeling kinda naughty. I hit the ground running, step out the door and I'm stunning. Better hold tight, cause you know what's going down. I'm setting the pace, cause this is my town. So get ready. Get ready.
Now I switch to this 28 to 75 millimeters for the group photo. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. The macro lens 105mm 2.8 was amazing. I really enjoyed shooting portraits with it. And the 28 to 75 is a wide angle lens. It's a, it's a all range lens that I carry with me all the time when I'm doing portrait photo shoots or any other kind of photography with my Nikon Z62. As I said before, I'm gonna do some videos about the macro lens very soon on my channel as well as the 28 to 75. So if you're interested, I would highly appreciate if you subscribe to my channel, if you ring the bell to receive all the notifications about my future posts. If you like this video, of course, and see you on another one. Have a nice day. Ciao.